Hello world and welcome back to another video from Superhero Review. This is Daniel and with me as always is... Maddie, I thought you have some fun from Superhero Review. That's right guys, it's time to have some fun with us and it is time for us to play some Marvel Strike Force. And on Marvel Strike Force today, we have a very special event going on. If you go in right there where you see Nick Fury and you click on events, you will see the Rocket Gambit, which is going on right now. You get the fragments for Rocket Raccoon. And Rocket Raccoon, do you remember him, Maddie? Rocket Raccoon is from... Guardians of the Galaxy. Guardians of the Galaxy. That's right. And so we've already done a couple of them. We thought we'd do a couple more on the video here today. And so let's go in and see what we can do while picking up some more fragments for Rocket Raccoon. Our team is as follows. Uh, we've got uh, some hard hitters in here, uh, which is uh, Daredevil. And we've got some protectors in here, like uh, Widow, as well as Hawkeye, and of course our tank, which is Captain America. All right, it's time to go in. Oh, and I forgot to show you, we have got our Civil War t-shirt on. So that means we are ready to go. Time to go in and try to get us some fragments for Rocket Raccoon. All right, so as we go through here, if y'all are regular viewers of the show, you know that it's time for the Maddie Minute. And so I'm going to close my mouth. I'm going to let Maddie do some talking here. And you are going to watch me go through and I'm going to try to beat the battle while Maddie tells you a little bit about what's going on in her life today. And what's going on right now and on the world of Maddie. So I'm going to stop talking. You get to watch this and listen to the Maddie Minute starting right now. So we are going to do a um event or something. Mm-hmm. An event. An event and we get to defeat them and we are gonna win. We are gonna win. And who who are we going to play? So like, Rocket Raccoon's there on the left and then there's Ultron on the right over here and we're trying to help out Groot. Remember? I am Groot. Groot. And so we're gonna try to help out Groot. They've got Groot. Uh, captive, and so we have got to go in and we've got to protect him. We've got to try to help Groot. So we're going to do that right now. So, Hot, so Hot Girl just did a power up on. Um, I think that was Black Widow. Black Widow? Black Widow, <laughs> Black Widow just did a power up, power up on our team. And now. Uh, that was Daredevil. Daredevil just um, took, took out somebody. Yeah, he took out somebody too, didn't he? And now I think Captain America. Captain America does a mighty ship. That's right. And now I think there's only one survival. So, so, so if you haven't seen Rocket Raccoon before, this is the abilities that he has. He has the attack, the primary target, uh, for 90% damage, uh, plus a... Uh, the adjacent target for 70% damage plus 5% critical. His next one is attack the primary target for 140% damage, 50% chance to gain an assist from a random ally. If Groot is the ally, then you also gain an assist from Groot and uh, apply a taunt to Groot. The last one here is to attack all enemies for 130 damage and gain a counter. So I think we're going to go ahead and just do the basic on him. So there's only one survival, and we're going to take him out, and I think... And there's Groot! Him. And what does Groot have to say? Groot says, I am Groot. Groot always says that. Yes, he does. And now I did, we won. We won. And so they're talking back and forth now. And now I think we're going all right, so we picked up 25 hero fragments for Rocket Raccoon. So There's Spider-Man, Spider-Man, he does whatever the spider can. All right, I say we keep going. What do you think, Maddie? Yep. Let's do it. So we have, we have um, Captain America on our team, and Captain America is good. Captain America is very good. Captain America. That's a mighty shield. It's yes. Stuck in my brain. So Rocket Raccoon is is um 
Let's see. He's a he's a raccoon. Oh, actually, he would tell you he's not a raccoon. He just looks like a raccoon. And there's Groot. We got Groot on our team now. Awesome. So Groot, Groot is going so hot. Is that hot? No, that's Black Widow. Black Widow is in. I can't. So if you are now going to go up against this team, you want to take out uh, that guy in the back there, the one that I have uh, selected on, the Pursuer. Uh, he's he's a very good character. So the first thing you want to do is go in and attack him. What's a Pursuer? Okay. Pursuer? That yes. means that he comes after you. He hunts you down. Yeah. So we got rid of him real quick. Yeah, we... And we're going to go thing. ahead and draw all the attention over to Captain America. Well, Captain America, we want to keep Captain America. Yes, we do. Then why are we drawing a... Look at that. Drew an assist from Groot. Groot. Drawing another assist in there. I like it. So, is that Black Widow? No, Black Widow is invisible. So... Can you see her? No. No, because she's invisible. That's why. Yeah. No. Oh, look what Groot has to offer. Well, so... Groot can heal all of the, he can heal all of the lowest, uh, let's see, heal all lowest health allies for 100 health and 3% uh, of this character's maximum health and 30% chance to clear negative effects on all allies. This one is gain death proof, apply death proof to two of the lowest health allies, very cool. Last one is to attack the primary target for 180%. So I think we're going to utilize the second one here. Let's click that one. So Look at so this, Maddie. Cool. Making six on the ground. Yeah, that was pretty cool. He applied death immunity to a lot of them, to at least two yeah. of them for sure. And Groot cool. is amazing. I like Groot. He is funny. And, Groot, and, and right now it's their turn and now it's our turn. We just took out one of them, and we're doing great right now. We are doing very good. We're doing very good. Yes. And I lost a tooth. <laughs> yes, and she lost a tooth as well. I wonder what Groot has to say. Ah, I am Groot. Yeah. That's what he had to say. Pretty much. He says that all the time. It's never he does different. say that a lot. It's never different. Okay. Take a number, pal. Good All thing. right, and I believe we've got 25 more fragments for Rocket Raccoon. Rocket Let's keep Raccoon. going. What do you think, Maddie? Yeah. Let's go some more. Let's go some more. All right, keep on to the next going. round. On to the next round, and like I said earlier, we still have Captain America, and I love saying Captain America does my shield, and it's just stuck in my head. And I like saying it because it's stuck in my head. That's right. So, Maddie, uh, you lost your tooth recently. Got that front tooth missing, didn't you? And the other ones wiggling. Yeah, you got some so, other ones coming. So. It ain't Christmas, but all you want is your two front teeth, isn't it? Two front teeth. <laughs> and a couple days after. No. Wow. Well, a couple days ago, one of was missing. Mm hmm. You lost them a couple days ago, didn't you? On Christmas, so I didn't. People didn't get to see me with my lost tooth on Christmas Day. Mm -hmm. It would be cool if people could see me with my lost tooth on Christmas Day. <laughs> oh. So, which one of these characters do you think you like the most, Maddie? We've got Groot on our team. I am Groot. We got Captain America. We've got Hawkeye. We got Daredevil. Uh, which, by the way, guys, I think that's my new favorite character. As you can see, Daredevil causes a lot of damage. Uh, of course, I always have loved Captain America. He's my favorite comic book character from Marvel. So, my two favorite characters are um, right now in, in um, what is this game called? This game is Marvel Strike Force. We usually play DC Legends. Uh, but we've been pr kind of frustrated with that game and spending a lot more time recently playing Marvel Strike Force. So we hope you enjoy playing Marvel Strike Force because we're probably going to be spending more time in this game than we have in DC Legends. And so you're probably going to see more videos from Marvel Strike Force. And whenever they go live, you'll have a wealth of information already ready for you 
here on the channel. So we've already started burning through a bunch of these and I think what we'll do right now is go in and take a look at the character that we just unlocked who is Rocket Raccoon. Rocket Here we go. Raccoon. So my two favorite characters on Mother Striker is Rocket Raccoon and Groot. And Groot, which work perfectly together. Marvel you, uh, In Marvel Strike Force, if you can get both Rocket Raccoon and Groot, you're going to have a very strong team. All right, there we go, Maddie. We just unlocked Rocket Raccoon at a three-star level. There he is right there. Now, the other cool thing is, as you can see, we have 77 out of 80. And when we, when we continue to do that battle, you'll see that there is more fragments out there that we can pick up. And there it is. There's still more for us to go in and do to pick up more for Rocket Raccoon. There's still one, two, three, four, five more nodes that we can pick up fragments for Rocket Raccoon. And so we're going to be able to take him to at least a four star here very soon and potentially even a five star. Maybe not quite that much just yet, but it will at least be able to get through to that four star very quickly. So if you take a look at the available team that uh, the available team members that are out there in Marvel Strike Force, we'll go take a look. These are some of the ones that we use all the time. You can see that top five there is our top five players. Uh, we've also got Gamora that we use as often as we can. And then as you go through here, one of the things you're going to notice is it talked about having Groot on the team, but Groot right now is not one of the playable characters. So we know a couple things for certain. Recently they unlocked and they gave us Black Panther, who you see right there. Now, what we also know is very soon we're going to be getting some characters like Groot. We're also going to be getting Star-Lord. All of those are... Uh, playable characters within the uh, story modes, but they are not playable characters yet to unlock on your team. So, two characters for certain we know are going to be on the horizon for Marvel Strike Force in the future. What we are going to be doing here very soon is we're going to create a video on what characters would you like to see come to Marvel Strike Force. So be on the lookout for that video. It'll be coming your way very soon. All right, well, I think that's going to do it for tonight. We hope you enjoyed the video. We want you to go out there and get some of those Rocket Raccoon fragments. My little princess over here, we enjoy playing these games, and we enjoy spending time with each other, and we enjoy spending time with you. All right, well, there's always three things we want you to do at the end of our video. Maddie, what are those three things? Subscribe. Subscribe to the channel. Drop a like. Drop a like. Comment. And leave us a comment in the section down below. So, who do you want to see in Marvel Strike Force? Are you going after those Rocket Raccoon fragments? We won't know unless you let us know in the comment section down below. Oh. All right, Maddie. Well, that's going to do it for tonight. And so, Maddie, is there anything you want to say to the people at home before we go? Even though it's not in my minute. Bye, world, and thanks for watching. God bless you. Have a great night, and don't forget to drop that like. Bye, guys. You heard her. <laughs>